but he's a seven here. Okay, I didn't have to hit the record button. These guys just started, and uh, welcome to stop number nine, Main Street Billiards. Phil P, Rahanna, and Curtis Parch is a seven. Hold on. Are we not in the right one? Slide over. Where we at? Uh, the scoreboard on this one is wrong. Okay. So hit the scoreboard here, here, and then shove it over. Just move it over. Uh, oh, I got you. I got you. Hit this over here. There we go. My man Phil P handling things as usual. And we're back in the building. Um, I don't know how many entries yet. Red AC. I'll get to you in a minute, and then uh, I'm gonna be. <laughs> I'm gonna be on. Uh, uh, the chat. So, uh, looks like uh, Curtis is going to be jumping at the one ball. Did they start already? I or? think they started that quick. Okay. We're over wow. here doing testing, testing. These guys are, are playing. That's uh, difficult jump here, uh, Phil. He can get over it. Yeah, it's very difficult. You got the edge of the two, the edge of the five. And the seven. And the seven. But he's pretty tall. Gives him a little bit of leverage. And he hits it good. Yeah, watch the cue though. Lost okay. the cue. Yeah, it's but okay. at least he didn't give up ball in hand. And the, and the two is kind of tied up. The two is, yeah. The two is tough. Though. So we'll see. Yeah, he's looking to go right between him and right into the two. Ball. Yeah. Because you don't want to turn over the table to Bobby Emmons. You turn the table over to him, he's looking to get out. What do you think, Phil? It's tough here. He's got to he's got to play safe. Yeah. I don't see a I don't see a shot here. That's Maybe good. a two way, but <laughs> this guy never saw a shot he didn't like. Man, he's aggressive. Very aggressive. You know, he's going, and you he's know he got after. <laughs> he, like he got rewarded. Yeah, little technical difficulties, but uh, yeah, this is this is tight. These guys are just going straight at it, Phil. You know, uh, he's, I don't yeah, know. He's got another jump shot, or can he elect to to kick one rail? I don't know. It looks kind of thin from here on on our our vantage point. Maybe he goes maybe, to the top rail, touch spin out, right? Do we have a different angle. Um, no, I think that's it for today, buddy. It's not live. Yeah. Or? I'm not sure. I guess not. Not yet. My man Phil Prince is handling things. So here we go. Um, currently, it looks like uh, Bobby's just going to cut this five in the corner. Comes right down. He's going to play the six in that corner, pass the ten, try to lay up on the rail to play the seven ball. All right, we're just checking to see if we had another camera angle. Handling some things in the back, and uh, Bobby has missed that six ball. Leaving Curtis, he has a cut shot on the six ball, but he's gonna have to go around the world to try to get position on the seven. So, uh, I'm interested to see what he's gonna do. Thin cut under. Oh, uh, see that route was risky to try to get back to that to the seven. That was tough. Take full of this. Oh yeah, that guy, man. He's just, uh, he's aggressive, man. He just gets up and fires. You know, it doesn't take him long. Look like he goes two rails back and play the ten and then oh, yeah. the same block. Yeah. You know, when I talk to Ernesto about this stuff, he always just 
he breaks it down. He's like, look, I'm going to stay on target and make sure I get out. Okay, so you got to, which one is it for that? Yeah. And there we go. Mez West Day Tour, stop number nine. Bobby Emmons versus Curtis Parch. We're here at Main Street Billiards in Mesa, Arizona. This is Rah Hanna with my man with the plan. Phil P. In the house, and Bobby Emmons goes up one game to nothing. You are watching the Mez West State Tour. <clears throat> and alternate break, you know, you have to uh, hold your serve, Phil. When you give that serve up, you're going to have problems. You do. It, it makes it a little more difficult with 10 ball because uh, right. more, more clusters. That one, one ball doesn't seem like it changes a lot, but it changes... Yeah, it changes a lot, yeah. And you know what? I think the most definitive factor is that break. If you don't break, you don't break and hold and, uh, you know, pop that cue like that. He let that get a little wild. He, he made two balls, two balls though. So yeah. am I. <laughs> Looks like he has a shot in the side pocket here. Yeah. I had to go back to school. I'm here <laughs> spelling out full names. Thanks, Dad. Missed you. Dad's in the house. Always making sure I run smooth. All right, Dad's going to see if we get another angle for you guys. And meanwhile, Bobby Emmons is on this run out. Pop the four in the corner, a little stop shot to gain the angle on the six. Well, he would like to go for a good shot. You know, it's a matter of preference, but he still has to get over to the side either play the seven up past the eight or play it down by the ten. Yeah. Past the eight. So is he gonna pop this out a little bit or just accept it? He just, just gonna that take stop shot. <laughs> Man. That's natural. <laughs> well, it's like two rails back to the nine. One, two. You can tell this guy stays on the road because he's just he's just super loose, you know. He's just super loose. He's not even. He just gets down and, and pumps him. He knows what he needs to do. He gets to he check that cue ball up real good and looking to play the ten in the corner. That was a quick game right Man, there. Yeah, this guy. <laughs> there we go, Phil. He's gonna keep us on our toes today. Yeah. All right. We'd like to thank our sponsor. Mez Cube. Remember, if you would like to try a Mez Cube, make your way down to stop 11 at Plush Park, Plush Pocket in Northridge, and ask to use the demo queue. They have six shafts available, and you can try them all. I love my 900, Phil. Uh, me too. It's a beast. Me too. Now, you want to see a break? You want to see some power? Yeah. Watch this. He's got a big one? He's got a big one. <laughs> he got a big one? Okay. If he unleashes. He's got a, that super amount of leverage. Yes. Being a short like me. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, he, he took some off. <laughs> he, he, yeah, he, he took should. some I off. can tell. If he, uh, if he unloads. <laughs> <laughs> it's monster it's time. It's monster time. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So now uh, he's well, looking at see, the he's deuce. Got, he's, got, he's got a one ball up at the top. Right. All right, well, what do you think Curtis is going to do? Is he going to be aggressive and uh, cut this one in the corner? Yeah, I don't think it's uh, Yeah, he's shooting. Going to, but I, I don't like this. I'll tell you this what did you do. Would you run into the 5-9? No, you know, I would hit the, the one backup table and the cue ball behind the 8-6. The right. Yeah, see, that's what I was thinking. He thought if he make it that the 5-9 would hold him there until he have a shot on him too. And now he, he left a shot. Right. Sometimes, you know, you want to be aggressive with somebody who shoots as good as uh, Bobby does, but you also want to make sure you limit his opportunities at the table. Right. Looks like he's going in the corner with this one. He plays the... Man, what a good shot that was. Plays the combo. He's just going to pop out a little bit, get on that three ball. That's a good shot. Vanessa says, always go forward when you can. 
Now, does he cut this in, Phil? Absolutely. No, no, I, I don't. I don't cut this. You're thing. playing safe. I play safe. The safe is the safe is easy. He's right. cutting it, but I, I don't like it. Well, you know, Bobby's a road player. He, he's, he's super aggressive, so he's going to try and get. This is why I don't like it. And that's a good call, Phil. And now he's behind a ten ball, and he's going to have to come with it. And he leaves uh, Curtis uh, run out table if he misses his hit. Yeah, he's got to make contact here. Yeah. If he doesn't make contact, he's just he's going to sell out. He's jacking up with some extra juice on it. Looking like he wants to dig into uh, that rail, shorten it up to come back at the, the ball. He's calling it. He's called the four ball. So he's going to juice. Three. Yeah, two rails, two rails shorten up with the juice. Wow. Right between them. Wow. And that's this game. It's a game of millimeters, man. You know? Game of millimeters. And he came with a good shot now. Curtis has to. Curtis has to take advantage of this right now, Phil. Yes. He's got to get out there. He's got to put some pressure on him. Not enough tablets uh, for the TV uh, table match for the, the live update score. <laughs> That's the one thing I love about the way We have a good time. I know I get caught out there spelling whole names out. <laughs> okay, and uh, Curtis looks like he's on a 50-50 here, Phil. Yeah, this is, he left himself pretty tight. Now, you know, uh, you know. The good thing is, uh, if he makes, fo just focus on making the ball. He gets position? I think he gets position. He might pop out a little bit. Yeah, well, he perfect. goes inside. He's there perfect. you go. I like when guys, they just get down, they know what they're going to do, and they attack the table. And just like that, the score is now. One or three. Right, there we go. We're going to correct the score. There we go. The score is 3-2. to 3-3. Three to 3-3. Three. Three to three. All right, we'd like to thank our sponsor. A big shout-out to West State Video Supply. The best products at the best prices. <clears throat> and if you need your diamond installed or you want to buy a diamond, retail or consumer, Diamond is the licensed distributor for the West Coast. So, see my man Donnie West of Sound there at West State Billiard Supply. And uh, Bobby Evans at the break. Let's see if he tightens that cue ball up this time, Phil. Yeah, he hit that one a little bit better. And uh, the one ball looks like from the side pocket. Yeah, he has a shot. A little straight. Yeah. I don't know if he's going to jack up and try to draw this back or go forward with it and take the tough cut on the two. Yeah. Looks like I, he's jacking up. Yeah, Maybe this, just try to st stop it right no, there. No, he's going to snatch it back. He's, you know, this guy is not the stop it right there guy. Yeah. <laughs> this guy's super aggressive. And just like that, Phil, he's back on the chase. You know, those little bumps and things, those are things that will cost you in the, when you're playing the big boys. Yes. You cannot, you know, you get out of line there, you put yourself in a little bit of trouble, but this guy, he's, man, he's a good shot maker. Because if you make balls, you don't have to play position. That's right. You know, and this guy's a beast. Make no mistake. to the seven and uh, if he does his job here Phil I think he's gonna be out now see that he just he lets his stroke out and, and he's got his tables down though. yeah he yeah he went that was just three perfect. rails <laughs> three rails to get there perfect. right <laughs> now he just rolls up he has definitely has swagger about him when he plays right yes. Yes. And 
you know. You know, that last is what you're looking at four three. I'd like to thank one of our platinum sponsors, Fast and Loose Designs. All the custom graphics and colors and banners and Facebook ads and patches and shirts. Scoreboard. Scoreboard. You see my man Chris Santana. One of the best in the business. Absolutely. And he loves pool. Support those who support you. All right, and then Curtis is up again. Scores four to three. Let's see if he unleashes that break a little Let's see bit. See if he breaks a little harder. Yeah. I've seen him actually destroy. Just, just hammer him. Just hammer him. <laughs> well, he's got the leverage, man. He's got the long arms, yeah. which gives him the leverage and the height. So yeah. he gets the pop built in, plus the juice. He's oh, still, he's, yeah. He's controlling his yeah, he is. Now. Yeah. Which is good. He's yeah. making a ball. And... Exactly. He's keeping himself, you know, in position to be able to do something, you know, instead of going willy nilly. Right. Long shot on this one ball to play the two on the side. So let's see if he elects to uh, roll it. There we go. All right. I think, yeah, he's just got to pocket the ball. Shape, Absolutely. Shape is natural. Absolutely. Now, this is those shots. You just bear down your practice shot. This is number nine in a series of 10 and level yeah. Q and just level stroke stick. right through this ball. Center ball. Kind of like, like that. that. Kind of like that. Like that. Ah, it was beautiful. Yeah. I, I, I like when uh, people execute well. All right. Draw out. Draw yeah, out <laughs> there we go. Draw out a little bit. Uh, he's has, he has an angle. He can float. I think he's going to just little, go, go forward. He's going to pop it little up. Little stunner, yeah. yeah. A little stun. Okay. Now, please get triggered. What do you do here, Phil? I come right up between the 9 and the 10. So you're going off the tangent line, 9 off and 10. Line, just float straight up, pass the 9 to shoot the 6. Yeah. He's got to have his speed hat on if he's yeah, going to do he this, does. right? He does. I like it. Uh, he can do that. Or he can, I like to go draw, dig in, two rows mm -hmm. out. But that's... I think it's tougher to play speed that way. Right. But it looks like that's what he's doing. Yeah. Maybe he thinks if he just gets past that seven, he's okay. And, uh, okay. okay. He's, he's that's okay. good. You he's know, okay. you know what? Okay. He did the best he's, with what he had. Yeah, that's a good shot. That's yes, it really is. Shot. He's got natural shape to the seven ball. You know what I like about this guy? He's not afraid. So, you no, know, he's not. He's not afraid he's about not. it. He's not afraid. He's like, bring it. Yeah. You know? And he's got the right angle. He's on the right line to just float it straight down he's and get used, on that he's tempo. He's used to playing in pressure situations, right? He's a professional Absolutely. Athlete, so. so it doesn't matter what the pressure is. He knows what's up. Top, bottom, to add. Thank you, Daz. All right. And, uh, man, we're all knotted up here. Okay. It's action. 4-4. Four, four. Dez is in a house. All right, and uh, now the score is now four to four with Bobby Emmons breaking. And uh, the last time he broke, he hit him real good, pocketed like two balls, and proceeded to get out. He ran to the seven ball, but he didn't get out. Now let's see what he does now. Oh, squirted right in the side. Caught a little off balance, and he's giving uh, Curtis. The ball in hand on a very makeable table here. I don't know. I don't know. I gotta ask my man Phil P. Is this guy gonna play this two ten? I I think he's looking to play that two ten combo. I think he's gonna shoot That's this one it. ball. That's ball in hand. Oh, it's ball in hand. Ball in hand. Oh yeah, he's shooting it. <laughs> he's gonna go right after it, right? Yeah, of course. He's shooting it. I don't know. It's a little little off the pocket though. Wow. 
he, he didn't get the right shape. He you know what? He, but he can play safe now, too. He can thin that two to play that combo and move the cue ball over here by those two, that four and five, if he wants to. What, what do you think about What do you think about Karim? No, he's, he's cut. Yeah, he's going to cut it. I think he's just playing the ball, the two. I think he's playing a ten ball, Phil. I told you he was playing that two straight <laughs> in the corner. What's the matter with you? <laughs> I don't know. I think I would try to play that ten, brother. Yeah, it's, it's hard. I can't see how far from this angle, how far it's sticking out. If I could get a free game, I'm going after it. You know, if he get if he if he gets on this five ball, it's a it's a good chance that we're going to see a, a lead change here. Absolutely. And that'll uh, that'll boost your profile. Yeah, he got a little short. But I think yeah, he's gonna, he did. He's gonna play this in the bottom gonna, right hand corner. Yeah, and just float there with position on him. Oh, oh man, he missed it. You see, and that little bit of getting out of the line—that's what cost him. And then you know he had to let up on the stroke a little bit to hold that up. And now he turns it right back over to Bobby. With a wide open hip. Yeah, there's no problems here for this guy. This, he just, man, this guy just lets his stroke out. He does, he does. He's one of those loose players, very loose, very confident player. Yeah. And, uh, you know, those guys, those are guys you, you know what, though? I mean, you know, I, I always say, man, those, uh, you know, like you said, Curtis is a pro baseball player, so he's used to the, you oh, know, yeah, he's, he's, he's used not, to, he's, he's like, he's like, okay, I made a mistake, I made yeah. a little error, and, then, you know, I, I got penalized for it right now. Look at this guy. He was bumped. bumped. Man, that was very fortunate. That's a fortunate roll right there. Uh, good player once told me, though, when you let your opponent at the table, every roll that he get, <laughs> it's your yeah. fault. Yep. Because you turned it over. Just like that. Just like that, buddy. 5-4. like to thank our cloth sponsor, Andy Beard Cloth. AndyCloth.com. You know, I've been dying to try the, the yeah. Andy Cloth. Yeah, we have it at uh, Plus Pocket. We tried it. It's good. Yeah. Oh, no, okay, nice. So yeah. next week, I'll get to, yeah, try you it get to check it out on the tables. <laughs> well, we get to see Curtis break again. And, man, you know, he's been making a ball. He's had, you know, some position on the, the next incoming he's been, he's ball. He's been controlling it. Right. Yeah. Right. Maybe he'll put a little pep in it. See if he can take some off the table. Any ones you can take off the table on a break makes it easy for you to get out. You put a little more pepper on that one. No, 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 seven ball, seven ball seven last ball rolling. Drops. Oh. <laughs> well, Phil, what's the call here, buddy? Now look at the two. Tied there's, up. There's, there's no point of making this one right mm -hmm. here. So what you're gonna do? You're gonna bank the one up table and put the cue ball down here by that uh, two nine. I'm looking to yeah. I'm looking to, to to dig into this and draw underneath the two nine. Mm. Yeah. Or, I, or or you know he may be able to come just sh straight down in between. Right. I mean because he was looking at here. Plenty of blockers. No, he is not gonna. He's oh. he's shooting the temple. You know it's not a. It's not a bad shot because the, where the two lies. Right. If he catches the the ten ball on the outside with that yeah, cue ball, you know the, the one ball might go down the table. I didn't even see that shot, but it's not a bad shot. As long as he covers. If he covers, he's okay. As long as yes. Exactly. He has to cover. If he just leaves it wide open, that's going to be a problem. It's, it's almost a free shot. It was. And you know, he didn't make the ball, but he left it tough. For Bobby, so Bobby's gonna have to, you know, he's gonna have, he's, he's got his work cut out for him, you know, this rack two with that two being tied up. He's kicking from the bottom, kick that one ball up table. Yeah, he's he's just creating distance at this point. Almost a bait shot. Go ahead yeah. and shoot this shot. Exactly. You'd have to have that hillbilly Bryant or uh, Larry Neville stroke right there. Yeah. <laughs> Super so juice. I like uh, I like thinning this mm -hmm. with uh, outside. Spinning it all the way back down table. Two rails, three rails uh, by the side pocket, one diamond below the side pocket. You see it? Yeah, that's a nice shot. 
and I said, oh, you almost have to draw up. draw a little bit and, and aim to, to hit that diamond, the top right diamond. Yeah. Like just that. like that. Yeah. Just like that. But a little bit, you hit a little, little bit. Mm-hmm. You got, mm. I can't tell. Yeah. But if, if he puts a little more draw on it, it mm -hmm. further, and he misses that eight, and right. then, he's, then he's perfect. Right. So now um, Bobby has the one pocket shot. Kick the one down table towards his hole. Yeah, I don't know if Bobby's going to try to make it. He's, he's firing he at the He is ball. firing Yes, he is. Well, Man. I don't. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was a pretty good shot right there. Now what do you think? Is he locked up on this nine ball? I think he, he Oscar Dominguez style banked that ball up table and juice him. Or he's going to put the two under the nine and put the cue ball somewhere else. But yeah. I think he should have took your shot, though. Yeah. Didn't get there. Because now uh, Curtis can put him in jail. Mm, it's not so easy. The safety isn't so easy here. Yeah. I mean, you know, the, the bank stop. The bank stop, yeah, yeah. With, with with spin and kind yeah. of send, this, send yeah. the two ball up table. Yeah, just create some distance. Or he can maybe catch the bottom and go one, two, three, and bring the cue ball up table. I think he's six. just going to cut it in. Wow. You know, you risk and reward, right? Okay. Good shot. Good shot. Uh, so, but, but what's next? I right. can't. Is that two, the two eight wired? Doesn't look like it. I don't think. I don't think that three eight. eight. Yeah, mm -hmm. I don't think it's wired. And, uh, you know, he's uh, been fortunate that he took a couple of chances and he's been okay but if he just takes chances at Bobby Emmons, Bobby Emmons is going to jump right on him. Uh, he got a rail but he get safe. Well, uh, Bobby can kick this ball and put him under the nine or he, he can, can elect to jump, jump it. it. Yeah. yeah, He can elect to jump this ball. He's, he's weighing it out. He said ah, alright. Bobby plays a lot of one pocket. And he did it Oh. And the nine ball got a rail, so yeah. he's good there. Yeah. I think it's cue ball sneaked out just a little bit. Right. Oh, tough rock right here though. You know you want to almost like spin this in and, right. and, and try to hit try to hit as fat as possible. Absolutely. To, to hold your cue ball. Or he's playing the side. No, he's going to okay. the corner. Guess that's all he saw of it. I you know what? Um you know, Curtis just has to take a, a hair more time and, and uh, you know, really concentrate on get, making these balls. Does he get a roll here? Mm. I think Bobby can still make this, huh? I don't know. I think it looked like Bobby's looking at the bank or something. Yeah, he... I don't know. He's taking more than five seconds. Yeah, so that means he has to say not an easy shot. So that means he's well. Is he? Is he? He's not banging it. Yes, he was. And, and he, he mm, and you know what? The balls always know who's winning. So right now, Curtis comes to the table. He he wants to be aggressive. He has the one pocket bank on that four ball cross corner. I wouldn't advise it. I'm, I, I'm laying trying up. To, I'm yeah. trying to put the four ball at the middle, well, bottom round. Mm -hmm. yeah. Just like that. But, yeah. Left it le leaked out a little yeah. bit. Yeah, uh, and you know, when you make the, like that mistake right there, that was direction and speed. Direction of the two ball and speed on, on that cue ball. He, he let him out there. You know, and you do that with um, you do that with a good player, man. He's going to make you pay. So let's look for Bobby here to you know, take advantage, him. man. Oh, he played. He played safe. He fi he wanted control of that table. He figured he gets ball in hand, he's gonna get out. You know, he's not gonna stall. And and being that, you know, this guy's a road player. This guy, he knows the right moves. Looks like Curtis might get his jump cue out here. All right, we're gonna see Air Curtis here. You know, I might call the ten ball here. Oh, catch it. Mm. I might call a ten. I might bank, bank, bank the four. Mm -hmm. and call the ten, but I would, I'd call the ten ball. So okay. I don't want to worry about the four. Yeah, he's calling it down here. On the pocket under him, he hit that ball good. You see, it's uh, yeah. He's he's not on the receiving end of a good roll there. No. He hit the ball well. But he is leaked out, and 
Bobby's back at the table. He has a shot on his. He has a shot on the five ball too. Yeah, he can see it. Yeah, he said, "Come on, punch right up." There he goes, back on the six and. You know, it was like we said, if he does his job, he should be out here. So, look for him to gain an angle on this eight to shoot that nine in the corner. Almost juiced it a little too much. Yes, he did, but little, is this two rails? Pocket. Yeah, two rails. Mm -hmm. There you go. Got it right perfect. He hits that ball on good, too. On top of it, though. You know, he, once, he, once he knows where he's hitting these balls, he doesn't care, Phil. He's yeah. like, okay, I'm there. I'm ready. You know, if the ball is lined up, I'm shooting. So, stop shot on a 10, and just like that. 6 to 4. It's 6 to 4. And Bobby has his, you know, Curtis has his chances. Sponsor Contact Point Media. Contact Point Media responsible for the live stream and live scoring. If you would like to have a chance to license this product, contact Oscar Dominguez or Desiree Rivera. Great crowd. All right, we're going to see Bobby's break. And you know, I feel this match is closer than it is on paper right now. Right, right. He's getting more opportunities because Curtis has turned the table. Yeah. And we need that one pretty good. So we can get it. Two balls. Right. And the balls aren't really tied up, so he has a good chance to get out. Let's see. Is he going one pocket player style and bank the one and bring the cue ball down by the traffic? Or does he, he get aggressive? He, I think he's going to bank it in the corner pocket. <laughs> he's left Curtis a kick or a jump here. I mean, and see the difference is when Curtis comes to the table, he doesn't like it. Yeah. When Bobby's coming to the table, <laughs> you know, he's open. Yes, he did. And got a, a nice, yeah, nice, nice roll. Nice that shot was a good Curtis. shot. You know, from where he was, he made the best of that opportunity. And, uh, you know, he left Bobby tough. Bobby doesn't come this. He, uh, you know, Curtis had a ball in hand. He has an opportunity to put him on two. But he, he's going in between the three seven. A little bit spin. of spin. Nice shot. Good shot. Catches a rail, so he's good. <coughs> but right now, Curtis has a shot. Curtis has a shot. Two ball is uh, in a tough position. Right. Here. It's in a little bit of no man's land. And you can. Can he throw that and get in that crack, or is he drawing to it back to the side? I think he's drawn to it, or he's playing safe. That's, nice that's shot. That's a smart shot. Yeah, we go. That was a smart shot. You know, I guess he's thinking. Unfortunately, he put it in a very in a position where right. Bobby can uh, kick this two rails. Right. Hit it good. There we okay. go. Okay. Now, now this, here we go. Now this is an opportunity. Curtis should this think this out execute. and get there. The, th the two to the three is, I think, the key shot here. Right. I can't tell if the three goes by that four ball in the corner. Right. He has to get a good angle on his two. Gets a good angle on his two. He's okay. Curtis has to be upset with himself right now because he had a, a couple of opportunities. He's not converting. You know, he's not converting. So he has to, you know, he's gonna have to come with another good shot here to keep, you know, Bobby from running out. No 
rail. Good ass, no rail. Does Bobby see it? He doesn't see it. Did he? Did he not see it? He didn't see it. Because he figured he was going to do he that. He figured it out. don't matter. <laughs> he, he said, okay, you didn't get there. Now you're in jail. And he put it by the, the two by the ten. It, it, yeah. Bobby's going to run him out if he gets right. the ball in hand. Well, this is a tough hit for Curtis. He has one, two, three, four, five blockers. And wow. a thin channel. I mean, Ernesto would tell me how to do this in two seconds. You know, go to the top rail, straighten it out. Yeah, uh, I'm looking to tie other balls up here. Right. Or oh, I'm looking to get in a crack. <laughs> no rail. Oh, you know, did he get no. a rail? Yeah, he's good. He hit the cue ball yeah. at the rail. Yeah, he's good. That was a good hit. Very good hit. Yeah. But he's just leaving the table open for Bobby. Yeah, but any shot's better than ball in hand. I mean, absolutely. hit the ball, it's better than ball in hand. Yeah, absolutely. Bobby's just going about his work, looking to maintain an angle on his five ball. He goes, that's a little shallow. He's but, okay. Uh, you know, yeah, he'll spin it. Spin the win. Uh oh. Did mm. he get there? I don't know, Phil. He's that looks there. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's okay. He's queuing like he has it. Yeah, you know, you know that's what it, that's what those good players do, man. When they have to get to that little spot, they make sure they get there. They make sure. So, what's Curtis gonna do? Is he's banking this in the side pocket. He's banking this in the side pocket. I think he is. And then he has to go three rails around for the seven. And he gets a roll. There you go. Now he's, he, that's a legitimate roll, and let's see what Bobby does. Bobby doesn't hesitate, calls a six in the corner. Coming off one rail straight at the six, looking to hit it in the face. And there you go. It's like what Oscar says, you, you hit it. If you hit the ball, good things can happen. Exactly. If you don't hit it, bad things can happen. <laughs> we know what's going to happen there. All right, so right now, uh, Curtis is going to have to play safety here. And he's going to have to play a good one, too. Mm. Wow, that was a nice touch shot. It was. And now I don't think he can see the edge of this, but. You think he can see the bottom I think of that he ball? I'm able to see the bottom of this ball. Well, this is what he's looking at. Stabs it right in. What a jump that was! That was a, uh, that was a good shot right there. It was very Oscar esque right there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that was that was a good shot. And uh, well, you know he's not out the woods yet, but this is the kind of shot he likes right here. Yeah. A little hot dog, Just a little back, stroke, little back pad, spin to the to the side rail and out. <laughs> he hit that ball super good. That was a good shot. And just like that, here we go. Seven to four. We'd like to thank our sponsor, Pius Events and Promotions, makers of the Excellence Ball Cleaner. Yeah, I had a chance to try it out last week okay. at home, and it, it looks great. I've, that's, I've heard nothing but great things about it. I only got a very small sample bottle. I think I'm going to need to make a purchase soon. <laughs> you know, up your dosage, huh? <laughs> All right, 7-4. Uh, the game is still in reach. If Curtis can, you know. This is, this is a, this this is a big game. game. Yeah, this, this is, is a swing right game. here. He has to win this game. Yeah, 
Okay, well, you know, Bobby comes, he's, uh, you know, he's, I'm, I'm going to say he's going to push here. I hope he pushes. <laughs> and if, he, uh, if he jump fires us in, I, I might walk away from him. <laughs> well, guess what? You called it. And he's jumping. I think he's just... No, he's jumping. He's, he's calling jumping. it. Yes, he is. He, he figured out. He said, you know what, Kurt? You're going to have to beat me, buddy. That's what he said to himself. He said, guy, you're going to have to beat me. And uh, how's he rolling? He's rolling pretty good. He's feeling pretty good right now. <laughs> Does that go okay? Curtis is going to have to go to grind mode and grind out every ball. Curtis going to get his jump, jumper out right yeah, now. Yeah, Curtis. There we go. And those tall guys, man, I envy them because they get they, they built-in leverage, they can, right? Yeah, they can get middle table jumps like yeah. this. There's no way. They, I, no. Mean, I, I can't even I gotta think about jumping this ball. <laughs> I got to stand on my toes and a step ladder. Yeah. So is he looking to bank the one safe? Where bank, bank safe. The jump, yeah. jump safe is looking to do And there we go. There you go. Jump safe. Exactly. But um, Bobby has the edge of that one ball, and he can slide down past the 10 and uh, play safe. Yeah. Uh, There's going to be a hit need to be called. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, it looks like uh, Curtis is probably going to go to the jump queue again. False alarm. All righty. Hey, Bob and I, Billy Dyke, and Sergio. Sergio goes to seven, Billy goes to eight. Time to interact, And he gets a good hit. And touche. Here we go. Now let's see what happens. Well, Bobby's doing the right thing. He's going to play, play the safety. Is he jump combo? He's, did he? He called the 10, Phil. Oh, the three ball, look where it's lined up. Yeah. Mm. I was a little ambitious. Yeah. But that's all he had. Yeah, he figured, you know, he's jumping straight into it. Those balls right. are tied up. Might as well right. call something. Exactly. It's like, well, you know, I don't have an open pocket, but I have this, so let me let me try. Just a little, little snatch on the three. There he goes. Gives itself the. You know, Angle, he's gonna have to go around the table again, right? Three, three rails. I see juices this ball. There three he rails. Goes. This guy's just get me in the vicinity and I'm good. Found one rail to the side now. I was afraid of that. I was afraid of running into that. Yeah. Well, you know. He looks pretty good here, center table. Yeah, once he gets to the free balls, he's he's dangerous. One rail to the nine. Little follow. Shoots to ten. Guy just he he knows what he's doing. He just, he just pockets balls. Yes, he does. Pretty cleanly too. I'd like to thank our sponsor, SoulCal Tap. You can check them out at SoulCalTap.com. And this is Rahanna along with Phil Prentice. Stop number ten, Main Street Billiards.
It's a beautiful room. I like this room. It's nice Thor's and done a really good job with yeah, this room. Yeah, this is I great. Like I remember when you introduced me to him at uh, Bull Shooters and stuff. I don't think it was. Yeah. yeah. And it's a nice place. It was good to see it. So right now, Bobby Emmons is on a hill. With him, with his break. Yeah, and he's been pocketing balls on his break, too. You know, this game was uh, within Curtis's reach, you know. He just didn't uh, capitalize. He had a couple of opportunities, you know. But if those opportunities go Curtis's way, I think we're looking at the opposite score. I think you. I think Curtis would be in the lead here. Yeah, that's the thing. I yeah. Mean, with with Poole, it's just you know, a few key shots can that's change it. the outcome. Of that's the game. it. But not to take anything away from Bobby, he's oh, playing. No. He's playing oh, great. Guy, the guy's punishing him. Yeah, he's playing. He's if doing, he gets an opportunity, he's doing what he has to do. Yes. You can't you can't control where the balls roll. You right. can just play them where they lie, and he's playing them. And he's, he says, you know what, he's like the line that senses the kill. He's yeah. like, okay, I'm going to get this guy out of here. Yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to maintain I'm my to, aggression. To, to, to cut this in, to spin it in. Wow. Let's see. Oh, and he miscued. Because he was, man. yeah, he was going to do your shot. He was going to spin cut that ball in. But now he's, uh, you know, I like to see Curtis get out here. You know, but he miscued and tied up the 4 9. <laughs> How you roll? Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Curtis is, uh, he's, he's rushing a little bit. Yeah, he's that's what I did. He's rushing. He's I rushing. Sent, right, right. You know, he wants to get back to the groove, and, you know, wants to give himself a chance to win. But sometimes you got to grind it out, bro. Can't be pretty all the time. Man, yeah, that's a little frustration right there because, you know, he scratched, he broke the balls up for him, he left them, yeah, you know, four of course. Getting, he is getting the, the, the bad end of the stick on the rolls, but he's yes. also put himself in those positions. On exactly, something. exactly. Well, the four must go. Unless he's looking to break this up. And he's looking to break it up. Did he yeah. hook himself? No. He's shooting too fast to be hooked. He's just spinning it in. Spin it, spin to win. <laughs> this guy definitely has swagger when he shoots. All right. He can shoot just stay right there. Mm -hmm. Gain an angle on the seven. To play that nine. He likes that check English. He check comes, English yeah, game. he comes right off the rail and the ball just dies there. Well, Ra, I think uh, that's all she wrote. <laughs> I think so. This, this guy, once he once he gets his hooks in you, it's tough. And uh, what a well deserved win. Bobby Emmons played good. Uh, took advantage of his opportunities, yeah, Phil, and he did 